hi coloring friends welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome in today's video is gonna be a little bit different i am going to be doing kind of like an unboxing unpackaging and just a little bit of testing of two new items that i got and yeah i'm so excited for this video and um let's just get into it <laughs> but um they are the tim holtz distress watercolor pencils and um you know i was perusing and just you know looking at stuff and you know as many of us do and i came across that uh, i came across these and um tim holtz did they just released it probably like a couple of weeks ago or something like that and i went on to amazon of course they're not there went on to scrapbook.com they were sold out so I was like, wow. So I really had to do a little bit of research <laughs> to get them where I got them from off the site that I got them from. So, but we'll get into that. Well, I'll let you know all the details and all that stuff. So, um, I bought two different sets. There is three sets. I didn't get all three. I just got two for now. Um, and I kind of want to see how I like them and, um, I'll probably end up buying the third set. But for right now, I got two. So yeah, let's just, um, let's unpackage them. And I have my little cutter right here. Um, they came really, really nicely packaged. And let's see if I can, oh, sorry for the shake. <laughs> um, yeah, so I just took them out of the other plastic the thing that they came in the original package and haven't opened them yet sorry for all the noise and these are from I did get these off of it is joggles.com and let me see if I can show you that so there's the information where I got them off of joggles.com and um I ordered them for my birthday which was on September 10th on Saturday and we are Thursday so I mean it was really fast shipping so I was very very pleased with that and they are they were 21 24 was the price and I, of course I had to pay shipping which was four dollars and 83 cents so 2607 is what I paid so yeah and that was for each one I really really love this paper super cute super cute tissue paper um, ruining it very nicely packaged really really like the way that they did the packaging to ensure that they wouldn't break so hopefully everything is intact so there's that set let's open this set I'm just gonna rip it oh awesome I got two little goodies I didn't even expect that okay we'll get into that two little goodies did not order those so those are probably you know little free gifts very very nice so um, they included two free gifts and they are stickles, my favorite. And they are in cranberry, perfect. I was running out of my red stickles and I had two. And Christmas red, perfect, perfect, perfect. How nice, that was a cute little surprise. 
toss that to the side. And let's put this up. And let's get into these. Oh, I should have kept my little knife out. So I can cut into it. Um, okay, so it's the Tim Holt Distress Watercolor Pencils. 12 woodless water reactive highly pigmented pencils. And this is the watercolor pencil set number two. And the names may look familiar because I know that I think they named them after like, you know, the distressed inks and distressed um, oxide and stuff like that. So I know I have a couple of these names um, and colors with the distressed inks and oxides. So yeah, this is number two. And this is watercolor pencils set number three. These are the two that I opted to get. I did not get one, but I'll probably go back and get that. Let me see if I can get this opened. Sorry guys. Bear with me. I just wanted to do a true unboxing with y'all. So, okay, so that sticker comes off. All that comes off. The sticker is on the plastic. It says distress. That is part of the plastic. And you have a nice view of them. Okay, let's put this to the side. All right. And I am going to look at set two first. So we'll go ahead and do that. Oh, it's got a little plastic thing. Does it come? Oh, yeah, you can pop it up so yeah you can take it off that cover put this back in there and yeah I just I'm gonna get it together one day I promise guys I promise 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 I'll get it together one day so now that I've mixed them up <laughs> without intentionally wanting to but let's take a look at the pencil. It says Distress Watercolor Pencil Barn Door. And they're woodless. I feel like this, as you use them, this can peel off. Mm -hmm. So there's that. And let's just get into it. Let's just, I want to swatch. I don't have watercolor paper because I don't really color on watercolor paper, but I have some scrapbook, um, you know, cardstock paper. So first I'm just gonna, they're pretty nice. They're smooth. Guys, and I'm not a professional swatcher or anything like that. So, you know, I do everything on a whim. So bear with me. But let's bring you in a little closer. So I got a water pen here with me. And... We're just going to activate it. Oh, that's nice. The water does intensify the color. We'll just do... a little scribble oh I really like these they remind me kind of I know it's probably different 
but they kind of remind me of the Derwent Ink Intense a little bit. I wonder, I don't know if I can go over it. Oh, I sure can. I can layer it. Really like that. These aren't the most perfect swatches. <laughs> so yeah, that's what it looks like activated. I'm sure, you know, you could share it out to make it lighter. So yeah, and this one was in barn door and I am going to open the other set. I really like the colors in this one. I kind of went for colors um, that I would use in my coloring books. So this one has like a brown, a gray, green, light blue. And I think this is what color is this? Fossil Amber, blue, purple. I don't think any of the sets that I got has a black in it. And I'm not sure if that is in set number one. But I wanted some browns and greens, purples. Let's open this one. This is set three. And I'll just kind of compare the two for the colors. So this is set two, set three, set two, set three. And I do see the difference in the colors. Some of them are similar, some of them aren't but I think they would complement each other very well. So <clears throat> let me put up set two and we'll swatch a color from set three. And let's do this blue. This is tumbled glass. Again, bear with me because I am not a professional swatcher. And I'm not pressing too, too hard, but there's a little bit of kick up. So let's go in with this, let me see if I have another brush. Um, this 
sorry guys trying to find another little brush yes let's I think this one has glitter hold on okay So again, like the other one, you can thin out. I really, really, really like these. Just wanna make it darker right here and see if I can just add more on top so yeah um i like them i think they are really really nice i think they're gonna be a great addition um to you know, watercoloring, um, coloring books, stuff like that. You don't have to go heavy handed. You don't have to go super dark. You can do light washes of color. Um, I think that they are nice, <laughs> like really, really nice. Um, let me just kind of, sorry, zoom you back out. So these are, um, these are, like I said, these are a new product that Tim Holtz put out a couple of weeks back. So, and there is um, only three sets as of now. I didn't get set one, like I said. I got set two, which is this one. And one more time. There's the back. And then I got set three. And there are the swatches <clears throat> excuse me they are not the best um, I am NOT a professional swatcher I'm not a professional colorist I'm not anything like that I just enjoy this and do it for my mental health and you know you know the spiel so yeah um, I am super excited to have these I'm actually excited to start using them and incorporating them into my coloring pages and yeah I think they're gonna be super fun um, they kind of remind me of the Derwent ink tints a little bit. Um, I don't know if anybody else has them and feels that way. If you do have these, let me know what you think. Tell me in the comments. Um, let me know what you think of them. Um, how do you incorporate them? How do you use them? Let me know if y'all are interested in these. Um, like I said, when I ordered them, I haven't gone back to go look. But when I ordered them, they weren't on scrapbook.com. I did find them, like I stated, on, um, sorry, I'm just covering my information, but they um, are on joggles.com. Super amazing seller. They have hundreds and thousands of crafting items. I've never heard of this store. Um, I'm probably late to the game and new to it. So, um, super amazing packaging y'all saw i got two free little gifts i wasn't even aware of y'all saw how it came packaged super amazing um seller i mean i absolutely love them um and they are located it looks like in rhode island um and i got it i ordered on a weekend on saturday 
and I am in Texas. So super fast shipping, like really fast. I didn't expect them to get here as fast as they did. So very, very, very pleased with that. But y'all let me know what y'all think. And um, yeah, and just, you know, sound off in the comments below. And um, y'all let me know what y'all think about them. And if y'all have them, y'all let me know if y'all love them and y'all are incorporating them in your colorings. And I will see y'all in the next one. Happy coloring, friends.